I was little, I was slowly going crippled. I could feel it, like my bones deteriorating. I could feel like pieces of it, like almost breaking in there. I don't like it. I'm not saying that for pity. I could feel it. That's why I wish we could move to the country. Because I'm going crippled? We could roam around in the field. Oh. Yeah. Almost blind in my right eye. I got problems with my legs. My arms hurt. My teeth are rotting. I got a bad back. I got PTSD. I got every kind of problem. My life's hell. People don't know that, but I can't really see out of my right eye. It's been that way ever since my dad put me in a dryer and set it on high. I can't see too good out of my right eye like it started melting. I don't know if y'all know that, but my, when I was little, my dad drugged me and put me in a dryer and turned it all the way on high because he was trying to burn me. I got one of the scars still. I don't know if you can see that. Like, marks. It's hard to see. I've been through a lot in my life. Yeah. I you, I thought I know that. Your daddy and grandpa would have went to prison. I've been shot, stabbed, uh, on. thrown down the steps. At school, yeah, kids people, threw me down the steps. Those people are going to go to hell. Yeah. I could tell you guys a bunch of stories, but I don't want to bore you or make you cry, so I'm not going to tell you. Yeah. I still can't believe that. I just keep thinking that. Sitting there holding a lot of money, getting ready to count it. All of a sudden, people just stop in the middle of the road to look in and point like, I want that. That's the same spot where Mr. Benedict sits in his golf cart and watches me sleep. Right there. He pulls his golf cart up there, Mr. Benedict, and watches me sleep. And that's the same spot where that vehicle was. And this is the same spot where I sat and watched that woman move the trailer with her big Jeep across the road. They still got that trailer out there so somebody can get it. Oh, yeah. You know what I got to thinking? Well, I get some ghost hunting equipment. Let's go to the cemetery that's right over there. Not a knot. What's that, knot? Knot. Yeah. I'm filming you eat your fingers. You hungry? No. You know what I wish? I had some more of those dark chocolate Kit Kats. Go get you some. I don't feel like walking that far. It'll help your leg. The gas station's far down that way. The only restaurants we got in this town is Pizza King, Subway, and some nasty place called William Reds or whatever. Oh, and the dairy. Oh, yeah, and the dairy. They got good food. The dairy's the best food. Well... The Dairy and Pizza King, they got the best food. I like their Big Sur sandwiches at Pizza King. Aunt Marty, you don't like Subway, but she eats there. Yeah, that's... Ow, ow, ow. Your chicken. If you don't like some, why do you eat it? Wow. That's about as dumb as somebody sitting on the toilet all day and don't even have to poo. <laughs> Makes no sense. Did you know Uncle Cy did that? What? You know, from Duck Dynasty, Uncle Cy. He said he slept on the toilet. That way, if he's dreaming, he can poo. Or poo while he's asleep. Something like that, he said. Crazy. Yeah, yeah. Huh. You see that woman he married? Oh, I see a glimpse of her big fat red head. She looks sort of handicapped.
He just liked to tell stories and stuff. So does that mean I'm handicapped? Cause it... <laughs>